Hey guys, welcome back to Handbuilt. Today we're going to tackle the problem of bicycles in the garage. In a workshop, it's hard to organize already with all the stuff that you have, all the tools. You see the issue that I'm having. I have bicycles and this one doesn't even have a kickstand. So I'm going to try to figure out how to put these on the ceiling today. I have three bikes here and they all vary in size and I'm going to try to hang them up. Where are we going to put the bikes? Up there. Where? Uh, why are you videoing? I'm videoing you. You're the star. <laughs> Hi, I'm Luke. Today, Daddy is going to just go up in the attic and organize our bikes. So here's my plan of attack. I'm going to mount this 1x4 to the ceiling. And then I'm going to screw these bicycle hooks into the 1x4. And hopefully that gives me enough support to support the weight of these bikes. I don't believe that there's going to be a joist in every area that I want. So I'm going to have to put some cross braces across because the joists are running this way. And then that'll give me something to screw this into. Um, I'm going to do this for the two bikes, the biggest bikes. And then the smaller one, I'm going to probably get a maybe a one by four by four and try to hook it closer to the wall. So. Crush your fingers, hopefully this works out. So I went up into the attic and I installed some cross braces that went across the joists. I used this to anchor the mounts into because there were, the joists were going the opposite direction of my bike mounts. Next, I marked where the hook should be to hold the bike in place. This is where I'm going to drill a hole to thread the hooks up into. So once that was done, I rounded off the ends of the board that was gonna have the mounts in it. There's no reason that you have to do this, I just did it for looks. And then I climbed up and I stuck them in place to see if it would fit. Yes, I know you're wondering, I am Spider-Man. Then I took my ROB Brad Nailer and Brad nailed it in. I'm just checking to see where the other bracket is so I don't miss and not hit it. So I Brad nailed the other side in. And yes, I came back with screws and I screwed them up into the bracket. Then I threaded the hooks in. The hooks actually were longer than the board that I mounted them in. So it just went up into the bracket above. Then I took the bike. Uh, 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 yeah, hooked it on there. Oh, don't knock the stuff off the fridge. Oh, looks pretty good. Yeah, pretty proud of myself. Then, in really fast pace, after I drank some coffee, I hurried up and put the second one up because I was running out of time. Yes, I really do work this fast. So I screwed those hooks in, and I picked up my wife's bike, which is way heavier than mine. Whoa, whoa, yeah. Watch out there, don't fall. So you have to orient the pedals a certain way to get to, to fit in between the frame on my bike. Yeah, looks pretty good. Yeah. And I shut everything off. Close that, everything's done. 
check out what I did, guys. Pretty impressed by it. And next, a word from the CEO of Handbuilt. 